Hello everyone, welcome back to a quick word in season. My name is Effa and today I have a word from the Lord for somebody. This word is not for everybody. But the Lord is saying there's somebody that is discouraged at this time. There's somebody that is asking why the Lord has not answered or why it's taking so long or how fierce can this battle be that God has not, you know, won the battle for them. My people, even as I begin to give out this word, I'll just say this quick prayer that the Lord will help you through this word to understand that he's a God of times and seasons and that he's about to do in your life what you think he would never do. He who promised is faithful. And so over the past uh, week or so, the Lord has been giving me um, his name as Jehovah El Gibor, that is Jehovah the mighty warrior, Jehovah the mighty God. And he gave, led me to the scripture in Isaiah chapter 42. I'm going to read it for us from verse 10. And that's why we see the title of the video, Jehovah El Gibor, the mighty warrior. God is saying to tell somebody out there, I am your mighty warrior. And right now I'm about to crush the enemy of your soul and destiny. I'm about to crush the one who has caused you to have repeated cycles of failure. The one who has sent you into this place where there is just nothing working for you. I am about to bring to an utter end the battles in your life that seem to be raging without being able to be put out. God says they will be put out because that's what I'm about to do now. Now. And I'll read Isaiah chapter 42 from verse 10. It says, Sing to the Lord a new song, his praise from the ends of the earth. You who go down to the sea and all that is in it, you islands and all who live in them, let the wilderness and its towns raise their voices and the settlements where Keda lives rejoice. Let the people of Selah sing for joy. Let them shout from the mountain tops. Give glory to the Lord and proclaim his praise in the islands. The Lord will march out like a champion. Like a warrior, he will stir up his zeal. With a shout, he will raise the battle cry and he will triumph over his enemies. Watch this, brothers and sisters. He says, for a long time I have kept silent. I've been quiet and held myself back, but now, like a woman in childbirth, I cry out, I gasp and pant. I lay, I will lay waste the mountains and hills and dry up their vegetation. I will turn rivers into islands and dry up the pools. And I will lead the blind by ways they have not known. Along on familiar paths, I will guide them. And I will turn darkness into light before them and make the rough places smooth. The this Thing, these are the things I will do. I will not forsake them. Praise God. We're stopping at verse 16. God is saying he has been silent and it has looked like he has just watched the enemy, you know, destroy you and batter you and oppress you. But he's saying to tell somebody out there today, hey, he said it is time and I'm rising up as the mighty warrior. I am rising up like a warrior. Verse 13 tells us that. Like a warrior. Friend, God is set to do a new thing. That's why he says to us in Isaiah 43, 18 and 19, he says, forget the former things. Don't consider the things of old. Don't consider the repeated cycles of failure. I am coming through for you now. I am fighting for you now. I am winning this battle on your behalf. I am surprising even the enemy himself. And even you will be shocked how the Lord is going to bring you out of that tight place and tight spots. My friends, I pray for you today that in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, that even as the beginning of this um, scripture I read from verse 10 says, sing to him, sing aloud. Declare his praise. Declare his might and his power. Declare that he will do it for you. God is saying, I will rise up and do that for you because I am your Jehovah El, El Gibor. God bless you all, my friends. I pray that this word encourages you. I pray that you rise up from every state of discouragement, every place where you are just, you know, despair, wondering what's going on. And you rejoice because breakthrough and new things are about to burst forth in Jesus mighty name. Please remember to subscribe to the channel. Remember to share this broadcast with someone you know needs encouragement. Oh, and my friends also click the um, bell so that you are notified each time I release a video. Have a blessed, blessed Wednesday. God bless you.